All eyes on one man. Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, clever little one-two, little passes round the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. It's Crystal Palace. They take on Chelsea, and we're live on EA TV. Hello on an absolutely beautiful evening for football here at Selhurst Park in South London. My name is Derek Ray and my commentary partner on this occasion is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Crystal Palace taking on Chelsea. Thanks Derek as always, this should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium, we've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. And here's the Palace 11. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre-backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. Well, Christopher Nkunku is getting the star billing, and with good reason. Stuart, what might we see from him in this match? Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him. His movement is excellent. And in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. Here's the lineup for Chelsea. Well, although it's down as a 4 5 1, it's more likely to be three players in behind the main centre forward. And those three are key to this team's creativity. Sterling. The cutback. In position. Oh, such an elegant finish. How about that on the volley? A brilliant strike, whatever way you look at it. Well, as you can see here, Sterling does so well to get his head up and make the right decision. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? Well, he knows that could prove to be a massive goal. Just look at his reaction. And the action underway again. The onus very much on Palace to find a response now. Jefferson Lerma. Plenty of support here. This looks more than decent. Will he finish? Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. But he's still got so much work to do. Just look at the strength he shows to hold off the defender and still get his shot away. That's a really good finish. Well, they needed that and so did he. Just look at the manager's relief there. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser, 1-1. Thiago Silva. Axel Di Sassi. Gallagher. No panic, just passing. Conor Gallagher. Chance to play it in. Nkunku, top class defending. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. Nkunku. Well, he opted for power from close range. He might be regretting that now. Well, he's frustrated, of course, but he knows they're now making chances. And Palace with possession again here. Effective looking pass. 
Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Moises Caicedo. What to like about that pass. Pressing high up has its advantages. I think the referee was spot on there. A free kick in the end after he had attempted to play advantage. Good distribution. Who can he pick out? Moving the ball nicely, but can they forge ahead? And a precise challenge just when it was required. Attacking possibilities for Palace. The defender doing his job. And Kunku. He's got to score! Oh, a smart stop. <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, the keeper won't be complaining about that corner kick delivery. His ball all the way. Caicedo. Enzo Fernandez. Keeping it moving dynamically. And Chelsea looking dangerous. And Kunku. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Well, he has to get his team plan again. This isn't going to plan. Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. Are you... Eberechi Ezi on the ball. And a free kick awarded by the referee. Beautiful pass. Making sure nothing came of it. Now the quick counter-attack could be on. And Chelsea get the decision from the referee. And appear to be on the cusp of being booked, but got away with that one. They've given him too much space. And a chance to whip it in here. Nkunku. Fernandez. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Klein. Beautifully weighted ball. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. The 
The delivery towards the back first. Thumped clear. And so the first half has come to an end here at Selhurst Park. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play. And the second half is underway with Palace behind. Can they turn this game around? It's going to be interesting to see. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Richards. Now with Lerma. Are you? It's there for him. Brilliantly blocked. Enzo Fernandez. Gallagher. Oh, nice ball over the top. It should be. Well, the goalkeeper making a big contribution and denying him another one. Well, it's another chance for him. As you said, he looks so hungry for goals today. Who can they pick out? And it crossed the byline. A goal kick as a result. Well, it wasn't superb distribution by the keeper, that we can say. Gusto. Palmer. Enzo Fernandez. Nice looking pass. Opportunity here. What a block! Running with the ball confidently. Cuts it back. Able to get his body in the way. Now we're into the final half hour. Well, as you can see, Chelsea have dominated the last 15 minutes. And their attacking play has been excellent. Surely only a matter of time before they extend their lead here. Yes, really going so well for them, and who knows, they might be able to craft another opportunity. Dangerous looking attack. Electing to cross into the centre. Oh, fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. Well, it's been a while, but these fans are now coming to life. Can they equalise here? Now sending it in. And the danger still on. Lerma. Magnificent defending. Axel Di Sassi. Palmer with it. Just to let you know, the club shop is open after. He has time to play it over. To get your tickets. Angles it back. Real chance. And it's gone in here. Just what Chelsea fans wanted to see. Their lead extended to two goals. Well, here we can see it again. He's shown outstanding vision to find the perfect cutback. And he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. Goal for 
minutes underway again with the score at 3 1. Ezzy. Encouraging move from Crystal Palace. Nama. Really good build up, but no end product. Sterling. Good weight on that pass. Klein. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Chris Richards. Lerma. It might be. And a fine stop. Given away by Chelsea. Are you? Enzo Fernandez. Connor Gallagher. Thiago Silva. Well, nothing like annoying your opponents when you have such an effective passing game. Palmer. A chance to whip it in. Well read to ease the pressure. Jefferson Lerma. This is Klein. Klein. And it's played into the centre. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Palmer. Well, Chelsea being afforded too much space here. Will he play it in? And Chelsea win the corner. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Short corner it is. Connor Gallagher. Sterling. And options in the centre. Well, a good tackle. Not the best challenge. Free kick. And that is full-time. Chelsea have prevailed. Three points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, Derek, it was fairly comfortable in the end because they were tactically superior, had better individuals, and were always a threat going forward. It was a really good performance and a good result as well. well really, no complaints whatsoever about his performance in this game, Stuart. Well, he scored a good goal, and if I was his coach, I certainly wouldn't be worried by him missing a couple of chances. The fact is, he was a constant threat today.